Hello, hello, happy Sunday. I hope that everyone is having a great day. Um, for those of you who are experiencing, you know, weather conditions that are very um, unnerving, I wish each and every one of you safety um, and that all will be well with you and your family. I would like to give a shout out to my subscribers and those who faithfully look at my videos. I do appreciate your support. For those of you who comment or just pretty much give it a thumbs up, whatever it is, I truly appreciate it. So thank you so much. Um, so today I'm going to be doing a thank you card for one of my um, customers. And that is my way of letting um, them know that I appreciate them and that they mean a lot to me. And it's not because of the necessarily the sales, but they could have gone everywhere else, but they choose to purchase from me. So I want to recognize them for that. Um, so the first one I'm going to do is, um, or the only one really for this video, would be um, someone that I work with. It's a co-worker. And um, she kind of likes the color. It's not exactly the color, but it's close enough to the color that she likes. So um, I'm going to be utilizing that as my card base. All my cards are um, five and a half by four and a quarter. And that's, you know, one of the standard size. And that would be um, here. And I choose to handwrite inside the card when I'm done. Because, you know, I think um, sometimes, you know, uh, type in, yes, it's your own words, but I, I really wanted to put my own personal self into it, you know, to my handwriting and everything. Anyway. Without um, further ado, I do have those here because she does love owls, so I'm making sure I include that. And I am using a bunch of um, torn scrap cardstock, yes, that I had, so I can incorporate it and make something like a patchwork. And of course, if you notice the colors in the owls, they're really colorful, and I just want some kind of a something that kind of pops because she is definitely a fun person. Um, whether in and outside of work, but of course, um, I want to just recognize her. So to begin, I'm going to go ahead and start just laying them out. This, these are not going to be in any specific pattern or anything per se. I'm just going to, um, you know, just play with them, just kind of stick them randomly, um, you know, throughout. And then we shall see how everything comes out. So... Here I go, just seeking everything up. And doing, of course, when we're done, then we will see how um, it does come out. And in that way, we can move. So give me a few minutes. When I'm finished getting everything stuck, I will be right back. Okay, guys, I am back. So here you go. So just playing around with the pieces of the patches and everything. This is what I came up with. What I'm going to do now, I'm going to situate it in the center of this card base. So hopefully this here can get your creative juices flowing. And um, if you have a lot of scrap and you're trying to figure out what to do with that scrap, then yes, this is something that you can think about and, um, you know, do it however you want. You can make it as squares, whatever you wish so that you can actually have something that you love in the end. So we're going to make sure that we center this as best as possible on the on the base here. So it is good and centered. Now I do have thank you here, which was I already did. And um, I think what I will do is I will go ahead and place those, um, get those up on a few of those dimensional squares because I kind of like those, to be honest with you. Um, so I'll just go ahead and post, put a few of them up here because I, I always like there to be some kind of interactive feel to my cards. That's why I, I love those and using the embossing folders. Okay, so we have that. Let's go ahead and get those peeled off and then we'll complete the card. Um, I will not put the name on there just yet uh, because I wanted to just show you the basic design. Um, 
So you can always decide what you want to do if you want to ever use that. So I'm going to place the thank you kind of in the middle, maybe middly, middly, just to make sure it is, you know, nice and straight here. Okay. And then I'm going to get the owls. Okay, so there you go. Here you have a fun card for a fun person, and that's it. So hope you enjoyed this video. I hope to see you guys back next week. Be safe, and we shall be in touch. Bye.